please do subscribe on my channel and click on the notification icon to get latest video updates hello guys today i'm going to show you a software that is for monitoring your internet data on windows and you can and there is an alternative to that it is the du meter which is which does the same thing but the main thing main problem with the du meter is that it is not free and you have to pay otherwise there will be a warning every time you use it then register now or buy the software so i'm um, today i'm going to show you a software that is free and you can easily monitor your internet data without any hassle on windows 10 and it is the software net speed monitor i will put the link in the in my description below so you need to download that from the link then you need to extract it okay there is two version 32 bit and 64 bit there is 64 bit and there is and the thing that you have to do is that you need to first make it compatible with the windows 10 if you don't do that then there would be some error something like that i'm just showing you that then you can see that there it is not supported for that windows 10 okay so we need to make it make sure that it it could run on windows 10 so you need to go to compatibility and then run compatibility mode run this software for the previous version of windows ok then double click on it then you can see that there is no error now then you need to click next next install ok the instruction has been finished so now what we have to do is that we need to find out that software Need speed. The thing is that it has been installed, and you need to find that out where where it has been installed. I just forget that. And here is Net Speed Monitor. It is the software. Just create a shortcut to your desktop like that. And that is the software. Now just double click on it and do you want yes just click yes then select your wi-fi or something like that click finish and you can see that it is now here configure it for and just increasing the font okay you can see that the font size and will increase and if i browse something like then you can see that and you can also just configure it for the kilobit to 2 kilobyte 2 byte per second okay now if you browse something youtube or anything you can see now you can now browse these things right away so the uh, thing is that it is free and you need don't need to do anything it is on it is totally free hope it helps thank you